Yeah. I can't explain this feeling. It's foreign to me. Bethany, and today I'm going to teach you how to turn these thrift store jeans into these jeans. Totally fashion forward, totally mom jeans. So, if you guys want to watch this video and see how I did it, then let's get on into the video. I found these jeans at my local thrift store for $8, and when thrifting, you want to make sure that you find some jeans that fit your waist and your seat really well, and then the fit around your thighs and your calves can be a little more loose. To mark where you want to distress, you can either use a chalk pen or just a washable marker. And then I went on to Pinterest and looked up some distressed jeans for inspiration for where I wanted to distress it. And when I marked these, I wanted to bend my leg so that I could see where it would naturally rip if these were ripping naturally and not forcefully. To distress these, I used a rotary cutter, but you can also use scissors. I also used a file and a cheese grater as well as tweezers. First, I am going to take a magazine and place it through the leg of the jean so that I am not cutting through both sides. And then using my rotary cutter, I would just make little lines and strips of cuts as to where I wanted the distressing to start. When you cut it this way, you are going to make sure that you're getting the white fabric still or the white lines, um, which is part of the weave. And then you're going to be pulling out the blue fabric or the blue strings to leave those white lines and that distressed look. This takes a while and you do it using tweezers, so just put on your favorite TV show and go at it. And you will probably spend like maybe an hour or two doing the distressing. I also did the distressing on the pocket and I'm using the same technique of putting the magazine using the cutter and then pulling the strings out but this time I used a file to loosen up those blue strings so that it's easier to pull them out rather than um, yanking them out it just makes it a lot easier to pull them. You can also do a similar style to the pocket on the back. I'm actually going to show you a different method using a trees grater. So what you're going to do is basically aggressively scratch the jean fabric. And this isn't going to give you that white um, string distress look, but it's going to give it like a little bit of a scratch. And that way you won't have things falling out of your pocket if you put small items in. Repeat these three styles of distressing over your entire jeans and I would suggest trying them on every once in a while to see how you like it and then you can add more um, because you can't put jean fabric back so better to have it less than regretting that you cut too much or cut too high. So yeah, have fun with this project. Overall, um, I did a medium amount in different places so this is how mine turned out and then go ahead and throw it in your wash on a normal wash and dry cycle and then it's done. That'll finish off the distressing, make it look a lot less artificial and it'll look super cute and I love these jeans. So tell me what you think and I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you like thrift flip videos, be sure to let me know in the comments box. If you have anything that you would like to see me specifically make, please also let me know that in the comments box and I'll be sure to reply to you. And as always, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You can do so right here. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye! I can't explain this view. It's foreign to me.